Konnichiwa, my name is Logan Charles Luna, and I don't like the thing that you like. So rather than hear about why I don't like it, you're just going to get mad and argue that the thing you like is the best thing in the world, even if you don't like it that much. Because that's just kind of the thing that's happened with just discussing anything, honestly. And then mainly, like, you get a lot of it in, like, the anime and manga community, but there's also, like, art and movies and music, especially, and sports, where it's like, yeah, no, I don't like that thing, or I don't like that team, or I don't like that song. And then, rather than people asking why and accepting criticism, because sometimes it is just criticism, like, well, no, it's not really good, like, you like it that's good for you but it's not actually good like there are things that I like that I know aren't good like Tommy Wiseau's The Room it's freaking terrible <laughs> like but that's kind of the point the fact that this person tried so hard to make this Oscar level movie and just failed so bad that it became this entirely different movie like there's a lot of stuff to that but like when people go like oh if you don't like like especially Dragon Ball Z and I guess now the big era parent is like Oshinoko it's like then you don't like anime or manga but it's like the whole point is you could go elsewhere and go like other stuff in that scene like anime and manga just you don't have to like what's popular and that's kind of the idea of the thing, that there's something for everyone. And some people like horror manga, like Junji Ito, and some people hate it. And some people even say that Junji Ito's art is bad. But they've never read Junji Ito. They've just seen, like, screenshots on Twitter or Instagram. And they're like, yeah, no, that looks weird. So, therefore, I think it's bad. It's bad art. And... It just expands into other things where people can't accept criticism of something and also it goes to like pro wrestling and stuff where it's like no but this company makes the most money and they have the most eyes on them and everything but it's all like yeah but if I don't like something or if something was bad or if they botched a spot and then they just act like oh well, whatever then I can call them out on that because that's a genuine criticism of me wanting the thing to improve. However, you know, just people get really defensive about stuff for no reason. And it goes back to the whole thing that everyone would rather win the argument and be right than actually think about what they're talking about and what they're arguing for. Because, especially in the music industry and, like, movies and even anime and manga, there's a lot of messed up predatory people that people still defend and, like, go out of their way to be like, but no, like, even though they were tried and convicted, the system was against them. But it's like, it was pretty overwhelming, overwhelmingly their fault. So, Yeah learn how to take a hit, learn how to be criticized constructively, by the way, and sayonara.